Hi, I'm here in Jerusalem um, near the end of a very intense three-day innovation mission. Uh, we're here at an innovation center um, after meeting with many different social entrepreneurs here in Israel who just exemplify the resiliency and the spirit um, with which Israelis are not only trying to recover right now, but thinking about how to rebuild in the face of this incredibly challenging time. I'm here with my amazing CJB colleague, Dr. Sarah Abramson, and the two chairs of our mission, Rebecca Leventhal and Michael Bonin. And I thought I would just ask each of you, just for a moment, about a person, a highlight, something from this trip that's really inspired. I, I think we saw the, really the best of Israel. Uh, faced with enormous challenges and enormous crisis, we see the resilience, the smart, the smarts, people with head, heart, and hand solving incredible problems, something we can really all be proud of. Um, I think everybody we saw uh, had like lost so much, either personally, family members, friends, um, and they're really candid about how challenging it is politically, emotionally, existentially, um, and they all decided to really dig in and problem solve, and I just think it's been amazing, like, just what innovative problem solving and commitment to pushing forward we've seen from everybody in the Wow. So for me, when you're sitting in Boston and you think, wow, we've raised $60 million, you're thinking about money. But when you come here and you see what impact those dollars have made, you see people smiling again, you give them the opportunity to cry, they see that we care about them, the dollars become meeting at purpose, and it just makes me incredibly proud to be from Boston. It makes me incredibly proud of everything we do, and it gives us hope that um, we will continue, we will persevere, and together with our community in Boston and our brothers and sisters here in Israel, Um Israel Pat.